good movies in theaters become great movies that you can rent from home. We have some that are now available for your viewing pleasure and they're Rotten Tomatoes certified fresh. Rentable entertainment on the hot list. Do you have the papers? Not yet. A government cover-up that spanned 30 years and four U.S. presidents is exposed by the Washington Post in 1971. And the Post looks into the decision made by the paper's fearless publisher, Katherine Graham. Okay, people are concerned about having a woman in charge of the paper, that she doesn't have the resolve to make the tough choices. Thank you, Arthur, for your frankness. Critics love this first ever pairing of Oscar winners Meryl Streep and Tom Hanks. The picks at 88% on Rotten Tomatoes. The way they lied. Those days have to be over. Another Oscar nominee, Phantom Thread, is at number two. I feel as if I've been looking for you for a very long time. When a young woman meets a dressmaker, his very tailored life unravels at the seams. Perhaps I'm looking for trouble. Stop. Daniel Day-Lewis says this is his final film, and for it, he snagged an Oscar nom. And the movie sits at 91% on the tomato meter. Whatever you do. Do it carefully. From Oscar nominees to a record holder, Paddington 2 is at number three. He likes his marmalade. I have a feeling he'll go far. Oh, he has. The Cubs sequel is the highest rated film on Rotten Tomatoes with a 100% score after 193 reviews. Not bad for a talking bear living it up in London. Come in. Take a seat. This time around, the lovable bear must clear his name when he's accused of stealing a valuable book. But the little bear's family and some newfound friends go all out to help. This is breaking and entering. We haven't broken anything. Finally, a movie you can rent while it's still in theaters. Borg versus McEnroe is at number four. The final we've all been waiting for. The world of tennis has never before seen anything quite like this. It's considered one of the most epic battles on the tennis court between the cool champion Borg and the hot-headed McEnroe in 1980. The film gives a glimpse behind the rackets of the two legends. The ball is alive! Chuck's all over! Yeah? I'm going to issue you a warning for unsportsmanlike behavior. Starring Shia LaBeouf, the movie also features Borg's son playing him as a teenager. The film is a smash with an 83% on Rotten Tomatoes. Apparently, uh, the only thing standing between Borg and that record is you. Ready, set, watch on the hot list.